This is the most popular coding interview question at every single top tech company. So we are given a value n which represents classes labeled from 0 to m minus 1. Now we are also given an array prerequisites where each element a, b means we need to take class b before we can take class a. So return true if we can take all the classes. Let's say we're given this example, we can take class 1 and 3 and then take 0 and 2. So we can take all the classes, we can return true. But let's say we're given this example, we are unable to take a class before finishing the other class, so we can return false. Let's go over the doll process, each of the classes can be treated as a node inside a graph, and if we need to take a class before another, we can draw a directed edge from one node to another. Now which classes can we take first? We can take the classes that has no incoming edges, then after we take these classes, we can remove the edge to allow us to take the other classes. Let's go over the code, create the custom node class with neighbors and incoming edges, implement the function can finish, create an array of nodes, create a queue, iterate through the nodes, if the number of incoming edges is 0, add the node to the queue, while the queue is not empty, pull a node, decrement n, iterate through the neighbors, decrement the number of incoming edges of the neighbor, if the number of incoming edges is 0, add a neighbor to the queue, return true if n is equal to 0, implement the function, create nodes, create an array of nodes, initialize the nodes, Iterate through the prerequisites, add the neighbors, increment the number of incoming edges, return nodes.